Hi friends, this is me Nidin, back with a new video. So in this video, we are going to see how to install Mac OS on your Hackintosh. So let's begin. First of all, you need to create a bootable USB. For that, you require a pen drive of size at least 16 GB. Second thing you need is a copy of installation image of Mac OS. In order to download the installation image of Mac OS, you need to have a real Mac PC. But don't worry, if you are a Windows PC user, then definitely you can use the Olarela forum guide to create a bootable USB. The guide is simple and easy to understand. I will provide a link to the Olarela guide in my video description. Please have a look and create your own Hackintosh bootable USB. I have already created an installation USB so I am directly going to the installation process. Now let's see the installation process. First of all you need to configure your motherboard BIOS settings. Without properly configured motherboard BIOS settings, you are not going to have a working Hackintosh. Follow my steps in this video for configuring your BIOS settings. Enter into your BIOS. Load optimize defaults. Go to BIOS features. Select fast boot and set it to disabled. Limit CPU to maximum disabled. Execute disabled bit enabled. Intel virtualization technology disabled. Windows 8 features set it to other OS. Boot mode selection, set it to UEFI only. Network stack, set it to disabled. Now move to peripherals. XHCI handoff enabled. SATA configuration, SATA mode selection. It should be AHCI. Now save and exit setup. This is a Clava Boot Manager screen. As you can see, that is a bootable USB installer. Before clicking on that, we need to set a proper boot flag in our Clover Boot Manager. For that, we can use the arrow keys and navigate to the options section which is a gear icon as we can see. Press enter. On the highlighter boot arcs, press enter key and we need to provide the boot arc. The reason why I am using this boot arc is that I am having a Kepler architecture based NVIDIA graphics card. So I need to provide the boot arc nv underscore disable equal to 1. After providing that, press enter, then press escape key and return back to the Clover Boot Manager screen. The reason why I am using this boot arc is that it is going to boot into a blank screen if I am not using the boot arc during the initial installation. If you are a non NVIDIA graphics card user, then you can ignore this step. Now click on the bootable USB installer and it is going to start the installation. You are going to see a bunch of lines like this. Please don't be panicked. This is a normal process. In the language section select English, click on the arrow key. On the top utilities, select disk utility. Now we are going to format our, the hard disk or SSD to which we are going to install our Mac OS. First of all click on view, select show all devices. Click on the hard disk or SSD to which we are going to install our Mac OS, click on erase. Provide a name, 
this can be anything the purpose is to identify our hard disk here i am using mac os as a name next the format set it as apfs in order to receive updates from apple you need to set it as apfs the scheme should be guid partition map then press erase now wait for some moment for the process to get complete